Again here with uh, David, and we are in Cambodia, the Russian market. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. How are you? Good. Yeah. Give us your name. My name is David, and I'm the artist, and we have like a stuff like a shadow puppet. It's made from leather. Shadow what? Yeah, shadow puppet. A traditional of Cambodia. Yeah. Right here. This kind of picture is made from a leather, it's cow's leather and it's a natural 100% fresh leather. And we use this kind of picture to play a shadow puppet in the theater. It's traditional with Cambodia. Okay. And we have like a, this kind of picture is traditional mask of Cambodia also. And it's the same story of the shadow puppet. This one is made from the pepper mache and we used to perform in the theater as well. The story about a Ramayana story. This one right here is Hanuman, the king of the monkey. Oh, it definitely looks like a monkey. Yeah. Okay, so exactly how is this made? This is a natural cow's leather. Yes, but how do you actually carve it with a knife? Uh, we use the knife, like like a nail, to make a hole and to make a body shape. Let me show you here. Yeah. Okay, you were telling me that your parents made these, right? Yes. Yeah, so what are these? It's a temple wrapping. Temple yeah, wrapping? Yeah, and the material is made from the rice pepper. We combine the stick of the rice with the pepper flour to make this kind of pepper. Yeah, and we're rubbing from the wall of the temple. Traditional picture. Okay, so. This one is the nail that I'm making right here. Right here, this one is made to make a hole. So you use one to puncture a yes, hole? Yes, yes. And this one is to make a body shape. This one to make a, like a half round of shape. Okay. This one is for cut straight. And this one, the big cut straight right here. Yeah. Okay. And let me show you how to make it. Yeah. Yeah. And the picture right here, we also have the drawing picture. We need to draw the detail. Uh, we draw the body shape. And then the detail I made by remember, by my memories. We just draw the body shape. Okay. Yeah. This looks like hard work. How many hours or days does it take to actually finish one of these? It's only like eight hours for a day. Yeah. I'll come on your left. Your right, my left. Depend on the picture. Some picture we make Louder. short time. It is depend on the picture. You know, some picture we make a short time, and some picture is a little bit longer. Just like this picture, we need to change like different nails, different shape. So it took a long time to make it. So you pick every tool and then you hammer it. Yeah, yeah. Just like that. And then you just pull it out. Yeah. And this you have to do for every piece of work? Yes. What if you just put one on top of the other and just cut it? Because it's make the on the bottom picture look like more bigger than the the top one. Ah, yeah. okay. That's why I don't so you can't that. copy yes. it. Most of the artists do that because they want a lot of pieces for one time. But I didn't do it because it's lost the detail of the picture and also it's look not clear cut. For me, only one piece is right here. Yeah. Okay. And you have a lampshade here. I see. That's yeah. pretty good. That's pretty smart. Nice. And yes, the creativity also. The what? Yeah. It's my creative also. Oh, you do this? Yes. And we have like different kind of... Lampshades lamp and... Shape, yeah, for the wall. This one for the stand and this one for the table right here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Really nice. So explain the stories behind these actual paintings, these drawings, these all this pencil work. What, what, what exactly do they mean? What do people see? What are are people supposed to see here? 
historically. Yeah, for this kind of picture, is Cambodian people is like focus on the traditional, and they, for Cambodian people, they want to focus for the traditional picture, and they want to save the original art, and they want to support the original art of Cambodia. Yes, but what does yeah. this mean? We have we have a mermaid, mermaid here. Mermaid right here is she's the queen of the ocean, you know. She's yeah. the okay. She's yes, she's the queen she of the also, ocean. Yes, she also the wife of Hanuman, and they have a baby. Like half of the baby is fish, and half of the baby is Hanuman, this monkey. Mm -hmm. Yes. And right here is the picture, the couple together. Put it down here. Oops. Right here. Yeah. Yeah. It's the picture of husband and wife together. Husband and wife. Yes. Yeah. Husband and wife. Couple picture. Okay. Now, you focus a lot on things in the back. Yeah. This one is my creative also. What is the sig what does it signify of the tree? This one is a tree of life. It's mean that you mean it mean that like you last long like a tree, you know. It's a good meaning picture and this one is the most picture that I saw love a lot. Yes. For well, that's just in this morning you can see that yeah, I just saw out this this size. Yes. It's a really nice picture and look classic. It's not modern picture. How long does it take to make one of those? For this one, is the biggest size is cost like four day or five day for one pieces, yes. including the drawing of the leather also. Yes, of course. Yes. And we make like eight hour for a day. And each piece of leather, of course. Yes, yeah. For me, I make each piece of leather. I don't, I don't make like two of one time. Okay, and then you, do you paint it? No, no. Oh, the paint, the color we paint. We have two types of paint. We paint as natural painting and uh, the chemical painting. Okay. Yes. If you want more like black color, like dark color, we use the chemical painting. Yeah. And the light color, like the brown, we use the natural painting. So right here is the original picture. Like original color from the leather, the brown one, and this one a natural painting. Natural color. Yes, nat no. This one is paint, but use the natural painting. We make from the leaf of the tree. I can almost see a human being in there. It's like a face. Okay. Yeah, it's natural painting. This is a lot of work. Yes, it's hard work. It's make a so, lot of time. So, uh, how did you study this? You know, this How old are you, first of all? I'm 22, yeah, and I'm study at a university. Yes, uh, year two, and my major is English. And I moved from Simbriet. Yeah, that is my hometown. And How far is that? You just came from a wedding? Yes, it just came from the wedding. Yes, it took like six hours on the bus. Yes, by the bus from Phnom Penh to Simbriet, and I learned from my uncle. He just my oldest uncle, and he learned from like the teacher, and we together we we, we first of all we learn from the pagoda, you know, what more pagoda, yeah, and they have a big big theater, big performance at the shadow puppet, so we learn it and we, we perform. We used to perform also before, yeah, but now we move to Phnom Penh and we start the performance. How old is this art form? Oh, it's you know, from a long time, very long time, you know, like from the King Soraya Vedaman II, like this art is from the first of the king who is building Angkor Wat Temple, the King Soraya Vedaman II, he found out this kind of work and like he from the tourists from uh, in Indonesia and he start to make it the new different shape, new different story, yeah, but the same kind of art, a shadow puppet. And we do have the festival of uh, shadow puppet of Asian festival. We have Thailand, Cambodia, and Indonesia. Yeah, and they perform together, and they also have a competition. Oh, really? Yes. That's interesting. Yes. Okay, great. Yeah. Thank you very much for your time. Yes, have a good day. Yeah.